This week on Must Have Monday. <laughs> bronzer. So bronzer is such an important part of your, well, my summer makeup routine. It is absolutely must have. So I wanted to share with you guys my must have bronzers. Um, all bronzers though, I just want to say, like, I mean, not all bronzers are used for the same thing. I feel like I have a lot of bronzers that I use for highlighting, some that I use for contouring, some that I use for actual like cheek color to put a little color on my face um, because they're just made differently. So you don't want to use a glittery um, bronzer for contouring, you know. So I just wanted to show you guys my must-haves since I feel like there's such a huge variety out there and you can use them for several different things. So the first ones I'm going to talk about are the ones that I like to use for contouring. My ultimate favorite bronzer for contouring is my NARS bronzer in Casino. I like this one because it's very dark and matte and um, I think that's pretty important when you're using uh, bronzer for contouring that it is matte because you cannot contour with shimmery bronzer. But this one is just really pretty and it's here. It's just a flat color. Um, really love that and I've been using it for quite some time and it's one of my favorite. The other one I like to use for everyday um, contouring is the Hula. It's a little lighter than Casino and I definitely plan on purchasing the big size of this because I really really like it and a lot of people talk about it and I can see why and this is really great for contouring um, especially like I said for everyday contouring it's a little lighter um, but it's not going to give you that really really dark heavy contour that you probably wouldn't want to wear on a regular day um, so I really recommend trying Hula for that um, and then my kind of medium in between those two is the um, Shimmering Goddess Bronzer from Flower Beauty so I really don't use this so you can just cut that side out but um, this bronzer is really great it is very pigmented very pigmented um, it's dark no shimmer at all and look at that it's actually probably the darkest one on here so I really like using this for contouring as well because like I said it's just um, there's no shimmer in it the next ones I want to talk about are some bronzers that I use more for color in my face and when you're trying to choose a bronzer that you want to use for color in your face you do not want an orangey bronzer actually no one wants orangey bronzer for like no matter what like that's just not cute but um, these I choose for color in my face because I feel like they're not really great for contouring. They might have a little bit of sparkle in them, or even if they don't, the color looks more of like a nice um, blush almost. So the one I like to use um, that's drugstore is my Wet n Wild Color Icon, and this is Goddess. And I don't know that I've seen this one before. I feel like they have like the really big ones now. There's the color there. These are going to be a little hard with swatching. I, I was hoping that they'd show up a little better, but they're already so close to your skin tone. But this just gives like a nice natural um, flush on the cheek. The next one is my NYX Matte Bronzer. And there's it there, and it's got like a bit of a sheen to it. So really like that. And mine's in deep tan. Um, so I highly recommend this blush. I mean... <laughs> I highly recommend this bronzer if you haven't gotten it. It's super affordable. And like I said, the formula is really, really great. It's very smooth. My e.l.f. bronzer and contour and powder. Um, and this is in, oh, it just says blushed and bronzed. Um, and I like this definitely as a cheek color because it shows up pretty well. But it does have more of like a rosy color too. And this just really reminds me of like the NARS um, do brush and blush and bronze duo just with the packaging and also the color that it comes with but it's definitely um, a good buy for the three bucks. The last one I'm going to talk about for cheek color is Max Miller Skin Finish and Give Me Sun and this kind of reminds me of Hula because it's so light but it does give like just a nice natural color in the cheek the next ones I want to talk about are bronzers used for highlighters and I have some really great ones for that. So the first two I'm going to talk about are um, the Maybelline Dream Sun. I believe these are pretty new and I have them in Glow Light and Glow Medium. So I'll just tell you this, I've been dying to get double definition from MAC and I'm probably just going to break down and order it online because I did see that they have it in stock. Um, but I was hoping to catch it in the store because I'm impatient and I don't like waiting for stuff to come in the mail. And then I saw these and it was kind of reminded me after I swatched them of the double definition. So I was, 
I'm still probably going to get it, but I'm kind of hoping that maybe they're like dupes for it. But the first one is, I'm going to show you guys, is the um, Glow Light. And it's such a pretty um, uh, light gold highlight that is just, oh, I'm so excited to wear this this summer. And it is right there. These are so pigmented and pretty. Like, I was so impressed when I swatched them at the store. I had to buy them. And you have to buy these. They are so great. Um, the other one, like I said, is also Glow. And they had, like, four seasons and, like, like matte ones and stuff like that. And the Four Seasons one had, like, four different um, shades of bronzer. But I wanted the Glow because I wanted, um, like, a gold and bronzy highlighter. And... These just are perfect. I wasn't even looking for something like this. I don't even know how I stumbled across it, but. And there's the medium. And they have just such a great finish and they come off really good. So these are a definite must have for summer. They're only like seven bucks. Drugstore, go get them immediately. The last um, one I'm gonna talk about is my Tarte Park Princess. Um, Park Ave Princess. So this is not a full size. This is like a sample deluxe size that I got when I ordered some Tarte products, but this is kind of similar. It's not as um, glowy or shimmery as the other two, but it does give like a nice bronze highlight color. So anyways that is all of my must-have bronzers and I hope this was helpful for you guys I feel like um, like all of these bronzers are great purchases but for different reasons so depending on what you're really in the market for will depend on what type of bronzer you want and if you have any suggestions for okay. me leave them in the comment section and like this video if you like must have Monday and I'll see you guys next time Bye. bronzer and this is also like a highlight bronzer to me and it's more on the gold side as well those are iconic bronzers <laughs>